My fabulous Goldie and Goldettes. <laughs> morning. Y'all, this morning I'm ready early. I'm ready since 7 30. Mind you, I was ready about that time, but like, you walk outside, you walk outside, and you forget something. Walk outside, you forget something, and then by the time you check the time, it's 7 50. But this morning, I was ready to leave the house at 7.32 and I know that very specific time because I was very proud of myself <laughs> 7.32 I was ready for everybody in the house anyways so <sighs> I plan that I waiting on down one day I see she behind me <laughs> uh, my kindness is taken for weakness so she rather iron her clothes this morning. Excuse me. She rather pack no lunch. She rather do nothing but wake up, be black, and leave the house. Yeah, this girl. I don't know what happened this morning. Nah, she begs. But this girl made me late for spite. I am shook. And y'all see how slow I walk here. Like look, my feet barely going. And she tail behind. Is only me or she looking further away? Yes. Yeah, she wanna make it up. So I won't be late. I'm very lonely. I had curry yesterday. So that's the only explanation that I have. Because um I like to send all obviously, but I didn't have any ice cream, but I wanted it. I didn't um eat any milk. No, I wanted it. <laughs> This hill, it looks so easy there. Mm. This picture doesn't tell the thousand words. That's okay. Right. So I'm gonna go. I wanted to go to town today. I spent out all my money <laughs> storing my life in it. Spent out all my money. So I don't know what happened, but I actually need to get two track pans ish looking pans for PE in school as they say my tights are too revealing you know those tights I wear to the gym and my ear coating all of that <laughs> so it's too revealing so I'm gonna try oh, I'm belly rolling hold on my belly actually rolling like rolling rolling not gonna end well <sighs> shit literally <laughs> this is why I hate let me look I hate, I hate this word this is why I hate walking when I have to go somewhere important like church and stuff if I have to go to Richmond Park or Mess Mountain like that I don't want to walk yeah I hate being sweaty and then having to go and sit and cool like if you didn't give me a chance I would like wear a vest and go up and when I reach somewhere for like my best or something I'd like change my clothes and put on my clothes like, I hate being sweaty I hate smelling myself everything that's what I don't like the most the only time I just let that be is like if I go to the gym and I come in home it's like everybody coming home so whatever you know oh, shit 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 That will never become a thing. I don't know what to put this on. Yeah, so I'm really, 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 really hungry. I have stuff there to eat. Eh? I mean, like, I don't have stuff to eat, but it has stuff to eat. But. I'm just gonna um, do some pumpkins. Onions. I'm gonna do some pumpkin for my parents, the mom, and then pour on it. Anyways, yeah. So I'm gonna do some pumpkin. It's a small pumpkin, but I'm gonna do a pumpkin on my parents. 
Typically, the only time I be cooking pumpkin is when I'm putting it in pie because I'm putting pumpkin in pie just so that you know I don't feel as unhealthy about it with all the cheese and stuff. I spit down lactose into it. They'll sometimes be riding me. So, but I can only cook for the air. I am hungry. You know, sometimes y'all ever like been cooking. I say been cooking, but I feel like there's another way to say that Englishly correct. But been cooking and like you're doing stuff, but you don't know why you're doing it. But you just know you're supposed to do this. Like, say for example, if I'm I don't have an example. Let me say, whenever you're cooking kalaloo soup, you must um, stir when you stir the pot, knock the, knock the arm pot with the spoon one time. It's like, why are we doing that? We don't know. But we do it because we know we're supposed to. That was just an example. Now that that's actually a thing. That's what I mean. I shouldn't be cooking and like, I just do stuff and not know why I'm doing it. Anyways, so. This is it here. Well, not really. So, I'm going to um, finish up or whatever. <laughs> I don't know why this girl is be so ghetto. Yeah, let's turn it to <laughs> To the black and golders. Chase, take a shot for me now. You have brought some money for me. You have used it during the week. You have used it before. We ask that you have given a fresh amount to today. Let your Holy Spirit move in a special way in our hearts and among us all. And let heaven come down today. And let glory fill our souls as we wait until we ask. In Jesus' precious name.
running with it so i'm making pancakes right and i tried a new recipe and this is a i feel like it looks it feels like um plurry butter <laughs> plurry plurry butter like it real thick and i'm debating maybe i should try one i don't think as i use this stuff hot um i put it in water to loosen it up a bit like it coming out so thick like i have a recipe that i usually use that is trusted tried and true and i know if it ain't broke don't fix it but in that one i had to use oil and you know when you're using oil oil makes pancakes or whatever you're using more dense so i was looking for one that would use shortening and yes they could tell you how to substitute oil for butter but it's almost basically the same conversion you have half cup butter use half cup oil but just to be on the safe side <laughs> I don't have any cinnamon to throw in this. Nice, give me a minute, okay? Now I added more water. It's still looking. But I don't want to add too much. But it's looking cute there. On the towel. It's bubbling fine. Just not bronging. Bronging. It's not getting as brown. Oh my god. But like I'm speaking so unenthusiastically. But I don't know if I spoke about it, but I've been craving pancakes for a while. So, yeah. We gonna wait. Okay. Go to the next one.